<laughs> my cat funny as fuck. <laughs> Look how black this is. The lover's card. How the fuck? What? How? How, y'all? How? How? And you know why this fucking seagull? go? I didn't even go tell the mother. They tried to copy. Okay, copy. Yeah, copy that one. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? But what the fuck? Black as fuck. All this stuff on the back of here is all good shit. You feel me? Why the fuck it look like this shit? You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker need a little shadow work. Oh, lying ass, I'm your lover. I wanna be your lover. Like, no the fuck you know. You want some ass, nigga. Just say that shit. Stop all that bullshit. You're not Prince. The prince talking about some hee hee. Like, oh my god. <laughs> They got boundaries and shit. I mean, y'all was fucking with some cheater cheaters. You know what I'm saying? Maybe that's where this shadow shit is coming from. Oh, the lover's card. Oh, free spirit, motherfuckers. Motherfuckers, this fucking flight on spirit ain't even free. You know, they might as well be like a motherfucker. Now get off with the free spirit. You getting a little crazy. Shit, what about a free soul? How about that? Let's switch it up. And a bitch start saying that on her channel. I'm a free soul. Where'd you get that from? Eternal Dragonfly. Trademark. Boundaries. I know y'all that found this channel and know I ain't a bunch of tech head motherfuckers on here because they ain't on my frequency. You can't fan it, can't shit. Happy as your mind. I'm about this y'all looking for a good tarot reader after a while, can shit? Tired of getting lost in the shuffle of that bullshit. Motherfucker, pan niggas and shit to sit on there. Bots. Bots are really people. I keep telling people that. They just don't have no brains in their head. Noodles, noodles. You know how brains look like oodles and noodles? That's all that is there. Most honorable Elijah Muhammad said we don't use a pin needle size of what our brain can do. Go get a pin needle and look on the head of that motherfucker. I'm about to show y'all because I got one like in mine. <laughs> And now, at least, shit. No wonder. Thank you, Jesus. Shit. The biggest the brain is, he said, we don't use it that much. You got a little of that motherfucking shit in here. Some of us use this kind of shit. I know I use way more than this, but I just say it. A body is a motherfucker that don't even use this much. Sitting on a motherfucking feed, you had to read for the motherfucker all day, and keep telling the nigga be patient. Like man, action, bitch, been action, shitty shit, world, world, work, work, bitch, clean up, clean up, everybody, clean up. Barney, bitch, remember him? The fuck? Oh yeah, the purple dude. Wisdom. A twenty-two. Some of y'all are builders trying to get to work. Not trying to be a jackass just carrying around other people's information. Just a walking plagiarist, these motherfuckers. Like, you know what? Where did you get that? Uh-uh. That's Eckhart shit. Uh-uh. That's Deepak shit. Oh, no, you got that from Oprah. She said, quit lying. Like, damn. What the original thoughts had in this shit? Fuck, man. Self-love. In reverse. That's why this shit black. Because everybody wants somebody to love them, but won't love themselves. Like, if, if you're going to tell a bitch like this, I'm about to get myself together and she get mad at you, you ain't asking the bitch to be patient. You just, like, hold up a minute, but you still kind of talk to her, can and shit. But I, I got to focus on me because this is a little bit too much. We got to sex shit. Uh, but ain't shit. I got to get, hold on. Hold on a minute. I ain't saying I'm going to block you. Just like, hold up a minute, baby. And she keep coming ferocious like a cat. Man, you got to dump that bitch in the river. Man, what you gonna get mad because I'm trying to get my motherfucking shit cleaned up. Talk about shit don't change till you get up and wash your ass, nigga. Shit don't change till you get up and wash your ass. Fuck. I fucking really be thinking, like, I'm not your God? Are you crazy? We're made in the image and the likeness of God, but you can't even call yourself that because look how you're acting, acting. 
You know what I'm saying? Find out who you are first. Maybe you'll find God inside of you, and maybe you won't, bitch. But what the fuck you ain't going to do is make me your God. Because guess what that's going to do? Leave me like the fucking first card I showed you with all that fucking shit on your back. You know what I'm saying? Trying to be everything to everybody, and it's nothing to nobody, can it, shit? Two, two, two. Some of y'all coming into a union. Look up that two, two, two number, because that's relative to, like, business, like, like couple shit, like, two people, can she? For real. Self-love. Y'all ain't fucking with people that don't got no self-love. Why would you? They will look to you to do everything, and nothing will be right. That's that tricky shit. I want you to be their nourishment and shit. And then they sit and watch you all motherfucking day to see how you're not pure. Uh, bitch, excuse me? I'm eating, bitch. Oh, we got mayonnaise on his mouth. I see that. They ain't perfect. It cannot hold. Like, shut the fuck up. Some of y'all got some dinner with some Virgos with that shit. Weird, bro. I ain't lying. Virgos on September 7th, September 2nd, September 30th again. Revelation. You know what I'm saying? September 6th. Motherfucking cancers like that. Oh, what is that? July 2nd? July 9th? July... Let me see if it's a July. Let me see, y'all. July 3rd? July 22nd? So it's a cusper candy shit? Well, the motherfucker don't have Gemini. That's y'all sick. Self-love in reverse. Because that's y'all seeing y'all dealing with that shit. Y'all definitely dealing with some cancers with that shit. Just a needy motherfucker. Damn, can I go to the store without you calling my phone every five minutes? I always start seeing the crazy in the motherfucker. Yeah, Ju uh, July 30th, motherfucker. Robust explorer, I bet. Ooh, that greatest challenge is seeing beyond the material. You see? A motherfucker got you working, working day and night kind of motherfucker. If you get a Virgo that's like that, they fucked up. Somebody fucked them up. If they birthday September 2nd, Somebody fucked them up. You don't get no thorough than a Virgo because our birth, our meaning is egalitarian. That means you look at everybody's shit. You been looked at your own shit because you a Virgo. Then you look at everybody else's shit, but motherfuckers like that, everybody else blame them. And if they let them, it'll literally put them right in this candy kind of shit. Be crazy as fuck. Nothing is good enough candy kind of shit. You know what I'm saying? Or how you second guessing what you did wrong, and it'll be some shit like you had that mayonnaise in the corner of your mouth, candy shit. So I lost your number, and will literally lose that bitch on a dark side. These July 30th, motherfuckers. Martic materialistic, mundane, and repressed. Whoa! <laughs> God damn, bitch! Oh, 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 so I'm about to work hard for the money every day, because mundane, mundane shit is just day-to-day -day shit. Get up, eat, shit, sleep, shower, shave. That stupid ass every day. Nine to five. Working nine to five. What a way to make a living. Can of shit. That shit up. Repressed. Okay, so if you are, that's your dark side, then that's something you have to work on. I'm not going to do your work for you, oh, shadow head ass hoes. But at their best, generous, they can trick you. Sensual can trick you. And ambitious. Because ambition can become obsession. Ambitions can become ego controlling. You know, don't know how to knock it off, right? Too high, motherfucker. Ambitious is a writer here, so you know what I'm saying? For real. September 2nd. I'm going to tell you the dark side of September 2nd because y'all already know why I don't want to work on my motherfucking self. I have no problem. Some motherfuckers ain't, ain't. On the dark side, a workaholic, passive, Y'all know I ain't that shit. I ain't even passive aggressive, bitch. If I tell you to go for fucking head on, you better do it. Because I ain't about to keep on. I'm going to punch your motherfucking ass. I'm going to kill your motherfucking ass. Just go fuck head on, bitch. Uninspired. We all know goddamn well. I mean, what the fuck? Oh, my God. Sometimes you got to talk about some David dance for his self candy shit. Encourage yourself. Stay doing that. You know what I'm saying? Their greatest challenge is putting themselves first. So a person like that, of course. And they born on a two. You know what I'm saying? That could be good or bad. Always giving other people the credit or always kind of like hand behind. You kind of shit like, man, you go. I ain't going. Go in there. 
can and shit. Shy motherfucker. Shy, play shy, bro. Work it, JT. Work it. You know, don't want to talk to her. You got to talk to her. Don't want to ask the waiter. Can you ask them for me, kind of motherfuckers? February 22nd. Hmm. And the shit I'm saying, ain't that birthday ain't got to necessarily be that if it fit, motherfucker. You already know that. On a dark side, detached, but the birthday of the investigator. So that motherfucker always in your phone. You know what I'm saying? Just... <laughs> Damn. You're not my soul anything, bitch. You're a free-spirited bitch. Just flying all over the place like Peter Pan and shit. Bitch, shut up. You land, land. <laughs> Detached, overcritical, and pessimistic, and an investigator? I know the fuck you lying. Damn, bitch. July 9th. Let's see. Okay. Oh, this is some old. Oh, really? Oh, wow. The lovable opportunist. July 9th, the lovable opportunist, a greatest challenge is accepting the word no. Oh, so you a rapist, rapist. Oh, I see how this going. Dark side, disillusioned, unrealistic, and withdrawn. But they vital canny shit. Like, what? Really? Imaginative and persistent. Oh, you nuts, nuts. You know? <laughs> I, think, I think it's time for me to get up and do my thing. I got it. Watch, friend. The fuck, bitch? I'm getting the fuck out of here running sideways on your motherfucking ass, bitch. <laughs> oh, shit. February 7th, the prophet. Your greatest challenge is get others to take them seriously. What if they a false one? I mean, I always say, they keep supposed to bad, but you ain't. <laughs> what about aggressive salesmen? Oh, they used to come when I did hair. Motherfuckers used to sell them cheap ass toys that are breaking two minutes while I try to push that cheap shit off on you, kind of motherfucker. Like, nigga, I don't want that shit, man. Know what I can do with that? I'm about to go get me a phone for phone, man. I'm sure with this inflation problem we got going on. Fuck away from me! Look at this on the dark side. Critical, unrealistic, and dissatisfied. But you a prophet. Oh, okay. You in a weird... <laughs> I'm dead, bro. For real. It ain't necessarily got to be on that birthday. If you know a motherfucker like that, yeah, oh, that bug for them like a motherfucker. There's one thing about them shape-shifty motherfuckers, they don't lie about any motherfucker. You know, some shit like, nigga, let me see your birth certificate, can this shit. For real. I'm for real. People be knowing you're going to back check on them. They be have told you that it's a birthday it never was, especially an opportunist type, type of motherfucker. Be not told you they birthday that because they know it ain't going nowhere, can this shit. But as long as the party keep going... They'll never know. Who the fuck gonna ask for your birth certificate for real? Cause niggas don't even be knowing your last name but be running up in you raw candy shit. Feel? Come on. And y'all know that. Like, nigga, this my middle name. This my last name. Just in case. You know, I give you HIV or some shit. Do you care? Oh, you don't. I forgot. September 30th, self-righteous, critical, and smug. Accepting that they might be wrong. I know it all, motherfucker. I'm gonna look at it. Ain't, ain't that Aries? There's a rough, rough. God damn, damn. Can't shit. Like, no, bitch. No. Not, I don't want to go out with you. You're nuts. They're calling my phone. You know, you get yourself in a whole situation just trying to be a human being. You know, it ain't just, it's just not the days of kidding. Say yes to a motherfucker. Lovable opportunist. Man, how you gonna love me and always looking for an opportunity? You disillusioned, unrealistic as a motherfucker. I bet you is withdrawn. You know what I mean? Like, beat it, beat it. July 7th, a beautiful dreamer. 
ooh, y'all gotta watch this motherfucker. The greatest challenge is dealing with criticism or rejection. That's that old telling the motherfucker no. Next thing you know, vengeance is there, say it's them. Like, the motherfucking Chucky, Chucky down on your case. Like, I know the fuck. Hey, <laughs> I ain't say yes to your hand in marriage. I just said that a couple times. Bitch, I just met you. We call it me, bitch. <laughs> on the dark side, they're disturbing. Naive, meaning they'll go with it. Anybody will do, kind of bitches. And self pity. Oh, here comes the blame game. Y'all gotta watch this, my fuckers. Right? Gotta watch this, my fuckers. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. July 6th, passionate attachment. What? <laughs> what? Excuse me? So you're going to passionately attach yourself to me? That's kind of weird. That's kind of crazy. Avoiding tunnel vision. Dark side. Obsessive. Blinkered. You saw my blinker, bitch. <laughs> and needy. What? Oh, so you got to attach me in, you needy? Oh, so you think I'm your god, god. Okay, this is getting kind of crazy. And given the light side, because y'all need to look at the dark side of motherfuckers. You gotta look at you gotta look at the dark side and order what the fuck you gonna sit up and gawk at the light side. Everybody get a light in the dark side. Like you're not gonna woo me with the light. Like no, nigga. Uh-uh. I wanna know what your dark side is. Is that some shit I can deal with? You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna just go to the sun. Oh, everything is so lovely. That's how you get into disillusionment. You know what I'm saying? Mm-mm. You know what I'm saying? Well, that sun is who you act around everybody. Nigga, that moon is who I'm going to be up at night ready to beat your ass. Nigga. Can I do or can I can shit? You know what I'm saying? Fuck, this is weird, bro. Mm-hmm. Lovers. Now some of y'all gonna start fighting for good reason. Not just because a motherfucker asked you out on a date and all of a sudden your mind go to motherfucking marriage. Bitch, if you thought so, you crazy. Even if I entertained it, that ain't set in stone, bitch. Ain't no preacher in here. We ain't at no altar, bitch. Who told you? You know what I'm saying? No tricky shit. Think a dick in a pussy gonna get everybody. That be the dark side of motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? If you stay in yourself and don't get carried away and use sex like motherfuckers really use sex, which really ain't nothing. They ain't doing no karma, sutra, tantra, nothing. You ain't got time today. Motherfucker, damn it. How many niggas done rolled off with the gas pump still in their shit? Because they forgot it. You know, I forgot it. I done rolled off with these nigga gas pump can shit. Because you just so busy ripping it around and got to do this, got to do that, fighting for this, fighting for your kids, fighting for your mama, trying to figure out what a bitch, a friend, a folk, and a bitch. Like, you be having a lot of shit on your mind. A lot of shit shit. Like, man, don't act like we in love, motherfucker. It's the weird seat. Y'all better get like me. Cause baby, listen. I live by two coats. R. Kelly's and I. Some of me, nigga, and we'll see. Motherfucker. Why don't you try some of me? Oh, fragmented ass nigga. You only gonna get a some of me ass nigga. Motherfuckers ain't whole. They be looking for you to make them whole like you, Jesus. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what? Uh-uh. We're in Aquarius age. No means no. They always did. You know, go ask niggas in the penitentiary. They didn't know how to knock it off. You know what I'm saying? But it's a con man. You know what I'm saying? And a motherfucker could be a good man, but they be turned into con man because if, let me tell you something. If you're a woman and you're dating these dudes that's blaming you for everything that 30 bitches did previous to you, and you tell that motherfucker, get out of the car and go find the 30. I don't give a fuck if you have to become a serial killer. But what the fuck you ain't gonna do is take all that shit out on me, bruh. I just met you. What makes you think you can just come dumping some shit on my back and I'm supposed to fix it? This ain't, I'm not Jesus, man. Go fight for a good reason. Cause that ain't the reason. I just met you, remember? 
Then yeah, use that shit when it's convenient for them. That old mirror magic bullshit. Like, I don't think so. You know what I'm saying? Our karma is complete here. Oh, past life head motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? That's what's going to end up happening. Y'all motherfuckers going to be ending up in a situation where y'all meet people. You might you might even have sex with a motherfucker a couple times. But you're going to realize it's some past life shit. You're going to realize it off Jump Street or before it can even get too deep. And then it's going to be like something going to just clear the karma where you don't end up always sitting here sick, transmuting for a motherfucker, life going in disarray and all that shit. It's going to be an in and out kind of situation like a motherfucking bank robbery. Since this motherfucker want to always be kind, man. Motherfucker done crossed you up. You done put your soul with too many, in too many hands, my nigga. A woman's job is to lead a man back to his soul. If you're gay and you're the feminine energy, then you need to lead him back to his soul through his ass, if that's what you do. But you better be make sure that motherfucker doing better and not worse after meeting your ass. The fuck? A hole is a hole, ain't it? You fall in one every time, bitch. The unknown. That's how everybody feel on the dating scene right now. You know what I'm saying? Bring a backpack. You know what I'm saying? Just in case. And have a gun in that motherfucker for a nigga that don't understand. No means no. Oh, fake ass birthday giving motherfuckers so they can hide. Controlling. Counting the motherfuckers extra. Liars. Manipulating. Calculating. Cunning. Full of gossip. Crew. Unfair. Possessive. You know what I'm saying? Stern about they possess and you just mad them. Strange, you know, restrictive. But that because they done got with a woman. That's like that. This is the king of swords and a woman sitting in a chair. So you tell me, Gemini, what does it mean? Men, Gemini. You know what I'm saying? But this is an androgynous channel, so does it really matter? However, know your fucking place. I'm sure in a gay relationship... You roll up at whoever the man is in the relationship, he gonna tell you to pipe the fuck down, candy shit. Shit. Man, ass motherfucker wanna act like they authority figures. And they not none of that. They splintered. And Pisces again. You know what I'm saying? Egomaniacs. The egomaniacs. Deluded. Trials. See what I'm saying? No me, no. Then they say, you know, you Johnny Depp like a motherfucker. <laughs> oh, my God. Arrogant. Unrealistic. You know what I'm saying? Don't give a fuck. Like, oh, really? Lack spiritual death, but be acting like this and say, oh, self-righteous motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Have you up smoking cigarettes and I, and you ain't a channeler. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you're on channel too, but yeah, how you going to cigarettes and cigarettes? Weird. All this causing towers. Like you're not even worth it, honey. I was over here minding my business, business. Yeah, I don't need you, bitch. I know how to put my own shit on. I don't give a fuck if my back ass, you nigga. You know what I'm saying? One day. You're like a motherfucker. If you got children, tell me, can you throw some of this on my back, candy shit? Like, I hit a wall on a nigga before I fuck around. Scratchy, scratchy wall. What the fuck? Just causing towers through a nigga penis. You know what I'm saying? And because they went bitches like this that can't get enough or don't know that a dick is a dick and sex is sex and move the fuck on. You know this ain't going nowhere, candy shit. Everything ain't marriage material. Remember that saying? You know? Does everybody parents get to clapping like a motherfucker? Yeah, act like they all truthful and shit. Because some of these motherfuckers are Aquarius, Gemini, I mean, Aquarius Cuspers. What is that? February, March. Yeah. Aquarius Pisces. Oh, they pop up. Oh, pop all the weasel head ass motherfuckers. You just sitting there being your beautiful head. They just keep hanging around. You know what I'm saying? Hanging around your page, hanging in your DMs, hanging in your inboxes. These men and women are light. It doesn't matter. These is motherfuckers that don't have self-love and they're looking for somebody to do it because they just don't want to turn in. That's it. It's all the fuck it is. What am I going to do with a scary person that's afraid of the dark within themselves? You know what I'm saying? I already peep what your dark shit is. Upon meeting you, can't shit. See, the motherfucker always want to know. How do psychics work? Niggas always love a challenge. It's like, 
I'm somewhat of a scanner. I don't know about another bitch, you know what I'm saying? But I will have to drop on your ass, you know, when you go hit that scanner at the motherfucking self-checkout line and give you that price and shit. That me. How long that take? Okay, that's why how long it took me, motherfucker. So everybody's so curious and shit. Fuck out of here. Exactly. Everybody trying to hand that shit. That's what I said. Don't get carried away with these motherfuckers just letting them pound you out just because they good in the bed kind of shit, but they ain't good in the head kind of shit. They ain't talking fellatio. They don't want to turn in. Only thing they want to do is think that you, they, they with egomaniacs and people that are upset. It's like trauma bonding. You know what I'm saying? But some people aren't bad people. They just get with a whole bunch of stupid bitches and they get to the point where God will just be like, okay, now are you ready? After running around Freddy Cougar candy shit, ending up in almost all these motherfucking nightmares on Elm Street. You ready? You know what I'm saying? Oh, I guess. And these grown men. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Sitting up there like they came dangling and shit. Money or no money. It's the truth. Motherfucker harsh, ain't it? Oh, well. Fuck you on a lie? The whole point. You keep on with that shit, bro. Not working, working. They think they dick can solve it all. They vagina can solve it all. Like, I just go somewhere and sit down and just see if you can find a place where it's a whole bunch of old people. You know what I'm saying? Go to a nursing home. Like, visit some of your family that's old in there. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and just just see if you're going to think about vagina and penis. Like, no, you're going to smell piss and shit in that motherfucker. Do you need a taste of reality? No, just your titty. Like, damn, where your mama at, nigga? Why she take you off so early, early? Fuck. Did you have pacifier in me? You didn't care, care. No. And too many of you motherfuckers can't and shit. And they want you to be their mother earth. That's going to be my mama. Like, don't call me that shit. Motherfucker call me mama, he out the race immediately. Maybe that's the part of the crazy Virgo. You know what I'm saying? For me, I mean, literally, it's a dead giveaway. What's up, mommy? What? You know what I'm saying? If I use the shit, I know what the fuck. It is just on some cool shit. You know what I'm saying? What's up, mommy? You know what I'm saying? Silly shit, poppy. On some Puerto Rican shit. Candy shit. It's panic shit. Because it means, you know, something different. Little catchy candy shit. Mama gonna be really mean in that shit. What's up, mama? What's up, mama? What? <laughs> Excuse me, nigga. Since when? Do I need to pull out my motherfucking ID to show you our last names don't match up? What the fuck? This illusion ass bitch. Got it bit in too many legs that ain't leading them nowhere, man. It's just a dead end, bro. Now you big man. You know saying tower. Oh well. Shit. What's that a scheme and scam? Let's be honest. What the fuck is wrong with that? And stop coming to women when you're dirty as fuck. And if you're dirty, then help. This one thing I don't understand. Just say, for instance, you met your soul family. This was this stupid ass separation shit. With ain't shit, but a bitch doing witchcraft that keeps you separated from a motherfucker. But my point is, if you know that show person, that, and you know it, hey, oh, we good. Hey, my fuck you, bitch. Just me and him. You know what I'm saying? I understand you was his wife. I understand you was her husband. Whatever the situation may be, bitch. But this me and you, nah. Keep going, going. Why are you stopping to address? 50 million elephant bitches in the room. They're going to stampede you. And then you're going to lose your girl. You know what I'm saying? Or your guy candy shit. You already fucking. You already not committed adultery. I mean, for you Bible thumpers, once you entertain the thought, you know what I'm saying? Jesus say, pluck out your motherfucking eye. Niggas ain't doing that. So let's just say you already entertain it, so you fucked up. You know what I'm saying? You've been cheating. It's infidelity like a motherfucker. Oh, all praises due to a lot that in that infidelity, you actually found the right person for you. Why the fuck are you so afraid of a bitch that you've been cheating on? You don't love that hoe. You been cheating, nigga. Do you get it? Get it? Okay, get it, get it with that one. 
She understands you fucked up. She's looking at your darkness. She's accepting it. That's a sign of unconditional love. Keep going. Run the ball. Why are you stopping? Motherfucker do this all day watching a sports game but can't get a clue. Like, is it just me? Oh, I'm schizoid crazy. Social Security want to take my money? Really? Well, how about they fuck off and go find the real crazies? You know what I'm saying? Put them in a hole and get their money back, can shit. Because now I'm traumatized from all of your weird citizens you can't catch. You know what I'm saying, Tupac? Fuck out of here. Mm-hmm. These are some people that don't know how to knock it off. They think they're going to keep coming because it used to be a time where you could kind of like stalk a motherfucker. But stalkers, God got some of them stalkers like this. You're not going anywhere north, towards anyone's house or car. You know what I'm saying? Quit calling the police. Who can't move their feet now, can of shit? For all you hoes that like to put pins and feet of voodoo dolls and shit. Like God ain't real. I don't understand that. How are you working with the unseen but don't think it's anything above the unseen that you're working with? That's how I know they be liars. You know what I'm saying? Just playing with resources because you're not doing any magic, bitch. You just... Uh, projecting your darkness out, wasting wax and herbs and all this shit. Why don't you cook a meal? Oh, I, I forgot. You're going to want to poison someone. Can't be shit. Yeah, some of y'all just about to turn to profit because somebody's penis became a tower in your life because they kept dumping on you. They didn't want to go back and try to fix it and recoup. These men would just keep wanting to go back and recoup. You're not going to recoup anything but a headache. Move forward. And quit telling people to be patient. It ain't time to be patient. Like, motherfuckers is being patient from COVID. How the fuck do you think you won't wake up tomorrow and, and not even wake up tomorrow, candy shit? But be patient? As fast as people die, you're saying be patient? You are out of tune and out of line. And I'm crossing the line in the sand. And you better stay your ass over there, candy shit. Final decision. You know what I'm saying? Some of them play these kind of games. Man, I'm telling y'all, some men are fucked. That's it. I'm done with you. Or you would say, I'm done and mean it. And then they call you back. And then before you know it, you back in that push and pull. And you just left some shit like that. Especially if you've been in a period of separation. You was in some soul flame, twin flame bullshit. With this old past life stupid shit. But no one, nobody want to deal with the here and now. And everything with the here and now is be patient and wait. Bitch, this ain't a restaurant. We can't go to those anymore, remember? And if we can, we're nervous. The fuck? Tell my hold up. Y'all have messed somebody else that's connected to some past life shit. Everybody with this high level soul, mate. If they can find their soul. You know what I'm saying, mama? Now here comes. Now you the ER. <laughs> Watch how motherfuckers get clipboards for these niggas. So you go on a date, gonna be in your backpack along with the gun. You know what I'm saying? Sign this candy shit. Fuck a nuptial. That you not gonna come for me when I didn't send for you, candy. <laughs> and crayon. Fuck a childish ass nigga. Now sign it, bitch. With lead. Here go a pencil. You see that gun? Okay, that's going to be the next lead in your ass. Because that ain't the one. Because at the end of the day, you all fucking end up like this. It ain't no joke being in them motherfucking mental places when you know you got all the sense and then end up in a situation where a motherfucker hounding you like, is she crazy? Ain't she crazy? But all the motherfuckers that's asking that question is the motherfuckers that's egomaniacs kind of shit. I is, I is, I is, I ain't your baby, bitch. Ask me that again. I said, I'm done. Why do you keep calling my phone? And then when you block them, here comes the uh, drive-bys. I don't fucking think so. Weird ass men. Go find the bitches that made you weird if you're going to go back that way or stay there and tell a motherfucker that's ready to ride out, be patient. 
Bitch, I might be a patient. And then, oh, you're going to be, oh, then you'll have survivor's guilt while you're fucking your new wife can and shit. Like, nigga, kick rocks. Go find who did it to you because it ain't me. And if a motherfucker rolling with your ass ain't doing nothing to you, but men be so disillusioned because they didn't got played by so many women because everybody's so plotting and cunning and go, you know, play it is just not checkers. Like, motherfucker, shut up. You'd be best to just go get a checkers burger if we still have those Americans, you know? What about White Castle? The fuck out of here. Figure it out, buddy. Kiss and tell. Just the game I play when I wanna say I love you. Oh, ghost it, be patient. Who is this? The threesomes they was having, Divine Fem? Or Divine Masculine after they left you with your face in the mud? You know what I'm saying? You was already a lotus can of shit. And they shouldn't appear negotiating with bitches because they think they're going to recoup some child support or a piece of property. Like, why are you waiting all that time for something you're about to be paying taxes on and you could barely pay the mortgage? Maybe God is telling you to get rid of that shit. Ain't, ain't nothing ever been wrong with bankruptcy in America. Start over. It's life. This is an LLC. It's business. Ask Donald Trump. Like, what the fuck? I'm gonna be holding on like this, Divine Fem, to one house. Standing on land is mine. No, it ain't. You gotta pay taxes, taxes. Why you unconditional love is a remedy. I'm gonna keep trying. He keep rejecting me. He keep dogging me. But this my, I don't know why I keep loving him. Ain't nothing wrong with that. That's good, good. Sign of life, life, can it cheat? But you're not about to take clear advantage of me and keep telling me to be patient. And you got it all planned out. You're not going to answer your phone and tell me anything about anything. And I keep calling you, act like my texts don't exist. But you can sit up with bitches and negotiate them and think your dick going to answer it. The dick is the problem, remember? That's what keeps creating those babies you can't pay for. For the bitches that have keep a man, baby. And they do that across color lines, you know what I'm saying? Since everybody's so sensitive about the word nigger, E-R, like a motherfucker. If I was white, I would say nigger and send a bitch to the E-R that was black that asked me to stop saying that. Bitch, shut up. Do you pay taxes or are you lying on them, bitch? You got nothing to say to me. Move on and move out of my face, nigger. I'm triggered. It rhymes, don't it? Hip hop. Fuck out of here. Now they just tired. After they rip and run with their dick in the everywhere. Just trying to figure it out. I'm going to fuck her tonight. And I ain't going to love it. I don't love these hoes, though. I'm going to do a little thing. I'm going to cross him up like this. And I'm going to do that. And before you know it, your ass crisscross up like a motherfucking crossword puzzle cake fan. Oh, which way did he go? And then want to try to keep your energy hovering over somebody that you, oh, she did love me. Kind of stupid shit. Like, uh, yeah. And she said, fuck you, because she's tired, tired. And you meet another motherfucker, and, and it's like, ain't no telling. Kind of shit. Walking off into the unknown and shit. Like, it's a Twilight Zone movie. Like, backpack. Just to go on a date. You gotta act like you're going hiking. Just in case the Uber driver rapes you before you get there kind of shit. Trying to talk to people like this. Stop going out late by yourself. You know what I'm saying? This is for men too. Because these motherfuckers don't give a fuck. They out of gas gas. Out of food food. Ain't no more damn stimulus check in America. Y'all know this ain't Canada. We ain't no other country. Ain't never hurt you. This a business. It's all we got. You better do good by it or you're going to be under a bridge bridge with somebody else coming along to tell you to move. No sleeping on this vent. Can it shit? Tell the truth of a matter. And why do you keep... Here they go. Dumb and dumbers. Keep on. This is how you know. But they'll tell you be patient while they do this. They'll ghost you, tell you to be patient while they do this. 
with a bunch of bitches or Negroes or white men or Mexicans or whatever the fuck that's in fucking denial. You cannot team work with baby mamas that don't have no brains in their head or don't use their brain or not even a pen size. They depend on you for everything. But that's what you mean get for always to get everybody's the damsel in distress or we don't have a happy medium. Either we're pro uh, liberation pro woman candy shit or we gotta be the damsel in distress but if we independent it's a little bit too much like and don't assume that we're that everybody's not the same you know what I'm saying you see how they look the same cause y'all keep getting the same people you know what I'm saying and then the bad film you try to ignore him cause you feel his energy coming back and now he wanna stand there like he had you waiting while these two dumb motherfuckers that can't find they Head from a hole in the wall, keep doing the same shit, putting them in further trauma. Now you supposed to fix it. You feel me? Candy shit. She got on purple because he all up in her crown chakra. Y'all feeling some of these energies. Now they tired. Oh, when you want to determine Mr. Chess Player, you know what I'm saying? With two powerless bitches, messy bitches, they don't got nothing in their head but fighting all the time. Or fucking, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to sit up in some energy like this. They'll put them in this kind of energy. The damsel in distress women. Oh, and I ain't saying stay-at-home moms. Because stay-at-home moms ain't a motherfucking joke. My mother was one. I ain't talking about that. Not normal people who man decided. You know what I'm saying? Don't have a problem staying at home because they want to see about their children. Not you. I'm talking about living off a motherfucker dime. A powerless bitch that act like she's doing something. And she's not doing anything but causing them more grief. And it's safer to keep her at home so you won't cost her more money can of bitch sitting up on the couch like this smoking weed all day on on his dime while you be patient divine fam and at the whole time ain't nothing but a motherfucking distraction and this, some of these motherfuckers think they can do meditation you know you ain't got plans she don't know i've been meditating this man though linear that's why leah sung that song back back forth and forth like i'm not about to do this wait no! You wait! And determined to make it work. Look at the difference on this shit. Even though when this card come out sometimes it's something different, but I'm saying they choosing motherfuckers that ain't shit. Just, just soaking oil up, can the bitch. Ripping and running, going nowhere, telling lies. And he's still giving her gas money. Why some of y'all divine fam struggling, struggling. You know, remember little man? You know, remember, hey, cutie. Now they tired because ain't shit changed. I, I, I would guess not. Changes were being made. They didn't like it. You know what I'm saying? Clearly, it was an unstoppable force, some of your unions. But if you're the one that decides you're going to stop it, then guess what? It's going to stop because some of these divine fans ain't stop shit. Some of these divine masculines ain't stop shit. They ready to go. What's up? Backpack on. We out this bitch. Be patient. I'll be right back. I got a piece of property to get. And then I'm going to do this. But they won't tell you that because they know it'll sound stupid as a motherfucker. And you leave their ass immediately. But they the man. What a 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 man. Some of these people's married to whack jobs. And then they sit up there and be like, you know, posting it online because they know you're going to be on there somewhere. Because they know they don't really love them. But, I mean, hell, if you can eat off a motherfucker, why not? You know what I'm saying? On some real shit. Why not? You're dumb. And I'm going to sit here with my powerless ass and eat all day and smoke weed because I have the munchies. Thank you, babe. Gonna go, you know, get some gas in the car so I can go over my sister, cousin's house, aunt's house, whoever, and tell lies. But I'm living the life, can she? And make them jealous of how balling I am. And I have a man that works and they have nothing, can hoes. Like, knock it off. That's a woman is an investment. A man is an investment. Y'all some bad investors. I swear y'all know y'all Bitcoin. Like, man, shut the fuck up. Come here like a knock, knock, knock on your motherfucking head, nigga. Instead of a tarot deck. That's all they do. Work. 
everything is related to work. You know what I'm saying? Everything. He tell her to cover up her damn eyes. She going to do it. But trust and know on her mind is penis, food, air back at the house. I got that weed left, candy bitch. I ain't stud no business. You know what I'm saying? Some of these divine mountains left y'all in the dirt at a crazy ass time. I'm talking crazy. Tell me y'all got bill collectors calling y'all phone. Y'all been neglected. Motherfucking bills do. And some of these motherfuckers, all they got is a cup of love because they out of money. Because they ran back to some shit that God was giving them the open door to leave. Some of them listen to their mama, their sister, their brother, everybody. Now they looking like this. You know what I'm saying? Where's the business minded bitch now? Looking goofy like yo ass kind of shit? Good luck, you know what I'm saying? And then you gotta feel some type of way. Cause it's like, damn, do I got more ego? You feel me? It puts you in a real weird spot. But men don't think like that. They so linear and it's all about them. Fucking ego. Like, I take everybody to face value. I don't date nobody with another motherfucker in mind. I never have and I never fucking will. Every man is a man unto himself. I ain't looking at what nobody did. I could have just got out of some tumultuous weird shit. I'm going to alert you that I have just in case you start doing some dumb shit that triggers me. However, how are you? What is your name? Here we go again, candy shit. Oh, okay. Got how many brothers and sisters? How many children? It'd be the same donkey dick dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? Then the next thing you know. But you ain't about to be staying in this shit. Y'all going to be transmuting niggas about y'all lives and they ain't coming back, candy shit. Thanks for the good time, and that's it. Ain't no pregnancies, ain't nothing. You ain't gonna tell me what God can't do, but a birth control can. Bitch, shut up. Good try, wrong motherfucking girl like a motherfucker. The lovers, free spirit. Some of them went as far as traveling with these motherfuckers, doing everything. Like, on some trying to work it out on some real shit, because they was cheaters. A lot of these motherfuckers was promiscuous. Infidelity was already in place. You need them. They say they leaving the motherfucker or, you know, they through a divorce process which probably was a total lie. You know what I'm saying? And then you get attacked all of a sudden. Where you're like, whoa, what the fuck is this? You know what I'm saying? Just like opening a closet and a bunch of motherfucking snakes just come out hissing at you. And some motherfucker trying to tell you to go get some water out the closet. You think you're going for water and open it up, and this motherfucking snake's on a plane can and shit. Like, oh, whoa, whoa, oh, hey, hey, buddy. <laughs> I thought you said the water was going to be in here. You just told me you was a snake keeper can and shit. You know what I'm saying? Then you get blamed. You get, it's like you just get through in the bunch. And when men get like that, they'll retract from everybody just so they can observe all of them. But the motherfucking one... Man, when I say hurting you beyond belief, that's why they say the twin fame journey ain't no joke. It really ain't. It's really soul flame. You can soul the soul with a motherfucker. Soul mate ain't no joke. Soul is not spirit. It ain't. It is not. Spirit is like personality candy shit. Oh, you got such a bubbly spirit candy shit. Spirit airlines candy shit. Motherfucker ain't called Soul Plane, okay? That was a different movie. Look at how different the two movies is if you need to do that kind of shit. Ain't the same. Go type up Spirit Airlines, or if you've been on there, you know that experience, and then go look at the movie Soul Plane. Two different motherfucking things. You want to look at snakes on a plane, do that shit. At least there's some transformation going on. King of Sewers. Now they getting divorces, but they was trying to work it out with some of these motherfuckers, man. Cause they tricky. You cannot fuck with that motherfucker. Ain't good, man. Oodles and noodles in the head. Rhyming. Fuck eating them bitches. Ain't read a book since a book read them because they depend on a man for everything. You're not supposed to do that. And I'm not no independent just because I said that. Depend on your creator. Even when you're married, God goes first. Who the fuck wants a wife that's going to look at him like he's God himself? And who the fuck want a man that ain't having God at the head of his life? That means if God at the head of his life, 
some bitch is. Or he got Satan in his ass because he doesn't slept with so many vagabonds, can he shit? And then you the clean up woman. You know what I'm saying? Why you sitting here struggling? Phone ringing off the hook, all this shit. And he's spending all his money over here so that he can keep something that's not even worth what you're spending just trying to be cunning and shit. This ain't the jungle, motherfucker. I don't even give a fuck if you is in the concrete jungle. It ain't the jungle. Go to Africa, take your ass out there and pitch black when it get dark and ain't nothing out there. And tell me whether you can handle that or a motherfucking project housing or a community where they at least got street lights in the bitch. I bet you bring your dumb ass back home, can't shit. If you make it from not being mauled half to death by a lion, tiger, bear, oh my. Yeah, now that money's slow. The money's slow. And they're going to be slow to give it to you because they done got played. So now it's trust issues. But the trust issues they're making is within themselves. Because you've been sitting there loving them unconditionally suffering. Ain't enough money you can give me. It was never about that. Put your money in your pocket, bro. Like, do you get it? I don't want you for your money. Even if you got it. Any woman with common sense, no, money ain't gonna get it. Sex ain't gonna get it. It's deeper than that. That shit ain't nothing but like sides. But you're making whole ass human beings side chicks? That's weird, bro. Marriage is like the chicken steak. I don't give a fuck if you were vegan. You used to eat that shit. Unless like you were a little kid that just couldn't take it no more. Early, early. You ain't never touched that shit, which is rare. I'm talking about motherfuckers that know the main course was the meat. That's a marriage. The macaroni and cheese and the corn and all that shit. That's the sex and the money. Of course, it's business. And that's what the fuck America is or wherever the fuck you at. You ain't living for free. Even in Canada, I'm sure they still paying rent, rent. Just making a mess, being in God's way. The only dog you just sit somewhere crying. Like, oh, good. Finally, some humbleness. Maybe he can heal the land. Like, goofy, goofy. Yeah, man. Some of y'all done, some of y'all left y'all divine masculine and had him looking like new money candy shit. But because he felt like he was partially healed, you know what I'm saying? Some of these dummies thinking they was fully healed. They ain't felt that good in a long time, candy shit. Motherfucker done lost hair. And ain't even, you ain't seen him in about two years, kind of shit. Motherfucker going bald like a motherfucker. I guess so. Playing with this stupid ass shit and then end up where you only a page of pentacles. And some of them working so hard to find film, they done got themselves to a knight of pentacles to try to make it. Because they don't understand it was never about that. How many times somebody got to say that? And you trust that what she's saying is true through her actions. She's just not talking like these other hoes. It's all they do is talk on the phone all day, smoke weed, taking up oxygen and shit, dropping oxygen levels. Little children just dying on the basketball court thinking it's fool who done murdered my son. The oxygen levels, some, a bitch at the house on that cell phone, ain't doing nothing. nothing. But it's somebody paying for it because she the damsel in distress and he's God and feeding his ego. Bitch ain't got no power. She know that. You're going back to do what? Be patient. Ain't but so much alchemizing you can do. You get sick. I know some divine fans that get sick. You really do. Them hoes be knowing that shit. They wicked as fuck. You be figuring out late like a motherfucker? Like nigga, maybe. Let me go talk to God about this shit. Because you might be Satan right now. Oh, turn karmic ass nigga. Just keep on clean up, clean up, everybody clean up. And she be loving that shit. I'm loving it. McDonald's, here we come. Especially if they got a baby. Oh my God, God. Men be doing some whacked out ass shit. I promise you. I promise you they do. Mm -hmm. I'll be back. And the ghost, it be witchcraft. That's what the fuck it is. They go back and get further entrapped. And that be God doing Because you left some, I gave it to you. I handed it right to you. All you had to do was get walking. 
You going back for what? That's a sham. It's a trick. It's a trap. I don't care if you got a baby. Keep walking. You might have a zombie. You don't know. Keep walking. Mm-mm. No. That's what God said. You know? And then sit in church with the bitch. Like, give me a break. What doing shit? You got to be, oh, you need to do this. Get motivated. And the next nigga you meet, you got to try to motivate him. And you be saying, I ain't got the motherfucking energy for this shit. And then he be, oh, hold on, because he realized your worth like the nigga that put you on pause didn't kind of shit. But then you the bad guy. You know what I'm saying? With both of them kind of shit. Like, motherfucker, I told you I just came out of some crazy ass shit. Let's not get caught up in that high level soul, mate. No, man. You better deal with reality as it is. What the fuck are you going through? Fuck all that title label shit. Ain't y'all sick of that shit? I don't know whatever happened. I want to be your lover. And that's it. Oh, we found a match. Oh, praise is due to a law. Weird ass shit. Oh, that motherfucker. If you suffer with me, you will reign with me, motherfucker. I'm sick of suffering. I was suffering when I met you, remember? I told you all about it in the car, kind of shit. I forgot. I was just tired of fighting. But put me on pause to go back and do more fighting? So I'm gonna remarry these motherfuckers. Or was headed to divorce court to change their mind, kind of shit. Now it's a final decision. I bet. I bet. Who the fuck want a man that's scared to tell a woman go to hell, bitch? Then fuck some paperwork. Since when have people been following the Bible? Especially in America. This is separation between church and state, bitch. You think we care around here? We don't. Get the fuck away from me. I got a towel and I see. You know what I'm saying? A hoe we a seat. Some of me. Motherfucker. Don't give nobody all of me. Man, that bitch be sitting there with another nigga trying to figure it out. But ain't doing shit. You know what I'm saying? It's a difference with a woman that take care of a man and handle your business. Some men recognize that and some men be assessing. And, and on some real shit, sometimes you will get a man that don't love theyself, meet you, and start turning shit around in goddamn two weeks. And you've been sitting up here waiting on this motherfucker that's been traumatized you after that and still ain't called you. Like, damn, how much ego work you got to do? Then that, then who becomes the assessor then? You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, he ain't that bad, can of shit. Uh, we'll see again, can of shit. Motherfucker, you ain't the creme de la creme to all and all, but then they say that about a woman. Act like she the only bitch on the earth. Well, you act like you the only dick on the earth. And I already know, fuck two niggas since you been gone, can of shit. Like, who do you think you are, Mr. Big Stuff? Well, I got the biggest dick in the room. You know what I'm saying? And if you did, I think it ain't about that. I told you, that was the sides, nigga. Fuck about macaroni and corn only. Even motherfuckers that's vegan get fake meat. Tofu. Fuck. Fuck make, they gotta make fake chicken in a minute. Ain't that right, Jay? Air chicken nuggets. That's made out of oxygen and carbon and shit. Hey, me. Spells be weak as a motherfucker. Spells wear off. And then you give her somebody money, you're going to work it out for them to further keep doing the shit they've been doing. They dead in the head. They got to do some work. Turn in instead of turning up. Right. Coco Chanel bags and shit on their head. That's all they got in their head is materialism. And look at the animals saying shit. I got my feather brethren on mine. I don't know about them a lot. Nature gonna be that it gonna do what it do. Why you sitting up there with your free will having ass? A woman but howling at the moon like a wolf. They about sick of y'all's asses. Take trying to take they spot. Like, you know what, God? Why don't you get rid of all of these so-called masters that are killing us and just see if you can evolve us and then we turn into a human being again since nobody came from apes, can of shit. Why don't you prove them wrong? Like, maybe having secret meetings with Allah while y'all masters is sleep. Masters of fucking nothing, can of shit. 
He in truth. Hurt your feelings. Who cares? Hey, you know how you care about feelings, motherfucker? Right. You know, somebody get into somebody, then here come. Oh, here come. I smell trouble. Some of y'all met some people or met a man. Shit was going cool. That little disturbance that happened, y'all told somebody whether it was a hater in y'all circle. So now y'all know whoever that was. I'm telling you, you got to remember, Deepak Chopra gave the game on that. Anytime somebody knew, if you ain't been talking to motherfuckers for a minute, you met somebody that don't nobody know, now you a little bit, oh, okay, I like him. You know what I'm saying, kind of situation. Okay, if you told somebody, that motherfucker, or whoever the motherfuckers you told that you hadn't talked to for a minute, and happened to say something, because we women, and we just try to be normal, and a lot of times when you are of the divine, you get isolated by God himself kind of situation, and you just want to share with somebody, but then figure, okay, this motherfucker's still a snake kind of shit, and you're going to the maybe not, okay, you're dealing with a oodles and noodle head motherfucker that just keep up shit kind of shit. Then, here comes the divine masculine sitting there like that dog on the two of swords. And you're in denial that this is even him even pulling some shit like this after you finally done kind of got out of the whatever devastation he left you in after ghosting you and calling your children little man and cutie can of shit. Oh, blame it on the rain ass nigga. Anybody will do. Yeah, here you go. Oh my, I know this motherfucker ain't gonna start this 5D shit again. Can't sleep, can't eat shit again. Why don't you go away, devil? Can't it shit. And still can't find the guard to pick up the phone? Something wrong. That's ego. That's weird. These motherfuckers know how to contact y'all. If y'all still on social media, divine masculine, if that's what the fuck he is, and ain't still a karmic from going back to a slew of them hoes, ain't turned back into after you did all the work that you did the first time. Ain't no motherfucking separation. Ain't no time for no separation. God giving niggas apocalyptic partners here. Now sit down because something about to go down. Yeah, it's called COVID. That's me. And no, nah, don't blame Wuhan. Don't blame nobody. I'm setting you up. It's the love of your life. Here you go. Sit down. She got somewhere to live if you don't. Fuck a property. I knock all that shit off the Monopoly board. Sit down. Here you go. Y'all love each other. I already know that. Been listening to prayers kind of thing. And then you defy God, turn around, go back like Lot's wife. Turn into the pillar of salt and then just sitting there like a dog looking dumb as fuck. While another person sees it immediately in the divine fam and ready to get it on. And still she got to try to help him because he in a situation with the same dumb shit she just left divine masculine out of. But at least he's trying to do something different. Calls me every day. Actually shows up. Keeps his word. Doesn't just leave me with no gas in my car can of situation. Now I'm just supposed to turn around and say fuck him. Oh here you come. Hi divine masculine. Now that you're soft. Well, it ain't winter. Don't need no salt for all the ice you left around my heart that this motherfucker also got around here. It's when a slew of other shit is going on. What the fuck y'all think y'all is? And y'all really think y'all dig like the middle, bitch? Okay, your money. All right. Okay. Praise God. And they keep hollering because some of them still trifling. Just walk along. How bad do you want it, kind of niggas? You know, I don't even pick up the phone. I don't talk to none of these motherfuckers. If they want it so bad, why the fuck your bills unpaid? Why you can't call nobody? Why you can't get no weed, divine fam? Some of y'all can't get nothing because all that money was supposed to go to you. God plans, man plots. So that means he handing out this kind of shit thinking he doing something. But his mind is in the hands of a creator that ain't no joke. You dumb bitches that only know how to shake their ass say ain't real. With four million other dumb bitches following her kind of shit. The same hoes they pay kind of hoes. While you sit at home and suffer. And they ain't even got the energy to help a motherfucker that might not be on some bullshit kind of shit. So how bad do they want it, Divine Femme, Divine Masculine? Sit back and wait, because some Divine Masculine's got their own money. They just can't find a decent mate that won't tell a bunch of lies or think everything is a fucking Disney movie, kind of bitch. Bitch, this is my life. You gonna help me clean it up or not? 
I'm helping you. You ain't got your shit ain't clean either, bitch. Be realistic. Unconditional love. Yeah, that's what y'all had. True story. And some of y'all got that because you just love itself. You know what I'm saying? Was doing root work for these niggas. Getting to the root of their issues and they turn around. That's a slap in God's face of that thing. Really not yours. Take yourself out of that shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Break through these guys as a tower. COVID. Sit down. Here go your woman. Here it is. Huh? I don't want y'all going. This shit's about to go down. Set it all up. And they ran off. Back to with that which they know not can shit. What can you do? How bad a motherfucker wanted. They can't even call you still, but can't hover around. Man, God gonna start killing people. Because you're not about to do that to people. You really hurt people like that. People be hurting. Love ain't no joke. You ain't even about an ego. You gotta be done. Clean cut. I'm out of there. Because that shit. Candy shit. And his women still on the train of love, waiting, hurting. And they men still somewhere stuck like this, thinking they about to be doing something. And God got their man, got them all wrapped up and screwed up. And they all this money they counting, they're giving it, they gonna be giving it away. Cause they think they going back for something she owed him and he's steadily giving it to her. Trapper. You know? But that's what they want, so that's what the fuck they gonna get. They won't move when God say move, so they definitely ain't gonna move because you want them to, divine fam. So walk along. You have to depend on yourself at this time and your creator, and that's it. Just like the animals, you know? Because man is terrible. All right, y'all. I know it's a little heavy, but it is the truth. Love and light.